Oh, uh, yeah. Uncle Bo Cow in the building. Y'all know what it is. Today, I am at Arby's. And uh, we got this new challenge. It's called the Diablo Dare. And I'm doing it times two. One is a brisket sandwich. The other one is a chicken sandwich. And it also comes with a milkshake. Get a milkshake with each. Because it's Tincture Tuesday, I got some Uncle Bo Cow Mellow Yellow. I'm gonna be putting that in the shake. Kick it up a couple notches, you know? So let's do that first. Let's get our beverage ready. Oh yeah, look at that. Uh-oh, I spilt a whole bunch. Mellow Yellow going in. Put a full dropper of that in, why not? I'll wait to do that so I can tell you how hot the other stuff is. Got tincture all over the place, of course. All right, let's get into this one. This one is it's got, looks like, oh, this is the brisket. This is a chipotle bun. Tastes pretty good the first bite. It's brisket. Um, a chipotle bun, it's, it's orange actually, the bun. You guys can see that. And it's um, got this spicy barbecue sauce. I actually got an extra side of this. Jalapenos and ghost pepper jack cheese. This is supposed to be the spiciest fast food option out there. It just came out yesterday. So I didn't bring any lunch to work. So what I do, I came to Arby's and uh, I'm gonna try it out. I'm not getting any spice yet at all. Um, it's a really good sandwich though, I'll tell you that. They gave me extra sauce, I requested it. That way I could slather it on and really see if this has any heat. Not really getting anything. Maybe a little bit. I just put a bunch of sauce on. Maybe. Maybe someone that hates spice, period, might get a little bit. My tincture milkshake. Wow. I turned my milkshake yellow, man. This is going to be, I bet you this milkshake going to be slamming, though. Actually, that sandwich is real good. I'm going to break into the chicken one next. Let you guys know what I think of it. Um, so let me wait for the milkshake so I think about this. Very, very slight back of the throat, throat, like burn. Just, I mean, I'm talking about like, like I just ate some Texas peak maybe. I don't know. That don't even burn me at all, but give it the benefit of the doubt. This is supposed to be spicy. This sandwich looks really good, guys. So it's got the jalapenos. Ghost pepper jack cheese, the barbecue sauce. And a breaded fried chicken cutlet or chicken breast. Wow, that's good too. I'll say this, it's really good. Both sandwiches are absolutely excellent. I mean, they're really, really good. Of course, I wish it was hotter. Um, it just doesn't have it with the heat, but you know what? It's a good sandwich, so I can't complain too much. I just wish it did have some heat. Yeah, I just don't have it, guys. Sorry. It's really good, though. This, though, wow. I don't like vanilla milkshakes, but it comes it comes with two of them. They say this, and they're free. They say that these sandwiches are so hot, they'll give you a milkshake to cool it down. I don't know how true that is. Of course, well, it's not hot, but um, anyways, I don't like vanilla milkshakes. I like chocolate, but put that tincture in there. Holy mackerel. That is so good. I've never tried um, 
tincture on ice cream or in a milkshake before. So this is a treat for me, for sure. All right, guys, let's kick it up a notch. Let's just, this is some hot tinker here. Let's do a full dropper of Mellow Yellow. Mm. Now my mouth and throat are on fire, big time. So we'll add that heat into the equation of these sandwiches. And now you are speaking my language. Now that's more like it right there. Mm. Oh yeah. My recommendation, if you don't have some, get yourself a nice pepper forward tincture. Don't get some flavored tincture, just want pepper. Maybe mix some in with the barbecue sauce. But definitely put some in your milkshake. My, my mouth's on fire right now. And it's just making this, making this food really good. This food's good without it though. The flavor. What I have here is their spicy three pepper sauce. This doesn't come on it, but uh, I wanted to kind of try it. Let me try it on the chicken first. This is good. I don't think it's hot though, but I can't tell right now. Woo! My mouth's on fire from that tincture, guys. Big time. Then the milkshake, I don't know if that's helping or not, but the milkshake's just loaded with it. Wow. That is good. Yeah, that is slamming right there. This brisket sandwich is on point. Mm, mm, mm. Arby's Diablo Duel. Is it hot? No. Is it good? Absolutely. On a heat scale, zero. On a fast food scale, a 10. There you go. Tincture is still burning me. Woohoo! Imagine having that kind of a burn with a sandwich like this. You would be in good shape. I'm gonna try more of this pepper sauce. Free pepper. I haven't been to Arby's in a while, so I don't know how long they've had this for. I know this sauce, the spicy barbecue, is new. Comment below if you've tried this uh, Diablo Dare. I guess there's, oh, I got this tipped the wrong way. So there's a TikTok, take the Diablo Dare challenge. There's a QR code on there. I don't know if you guys can see that. But uh, I decided to do the double, the double Diablo Dare. Do two sandwiches and uh, kind of rate it, you know. I just came out yesterday and I was interested in it. Actually, um, I seen a picture. Colton from Rock and Heat. If you guys haven't done so, check out his channel. He actually um, posted a picture of him with, I think it was the chicken sandwich, and said he he put some pulleys hot sauce on it. So, uh, you know, I knew it couldn't be that hot, but I had to come check it out for myself. That three pepper sauce on the chicken, straight money. 
It's really good. Um, but the barbecue sauce is better on the brisket. So, this, I wish I could just take a sip of it. That's good. That's a sweet sauce. You can taste the pepper in it a little bit. So it does have some heat, but I'm talking about, I mean, you, you wouldn't even be able to re register it on a, a scale as, as a one, because a one, you know, talking a jalapeno or some hot sauce in the store, stuff like that. Um, but it's got a little, little bit of a bite to it. For a non-chili head, they might be able to feel the feel the, um, the heat in it a little bit, but it wouldn't light anyone up, period. Not even my five-year-old daughter. So that's where we're at, guys. Yeah, this is where this is where the money is right here. Show you guys that. That's that tincture shake right there, guys. Uncle Boca, I'm gonna finish my lunch. I love you guys. Let me know if you've tried this challenge, the the two of them, two sandwiches. Or if you just tried the Diablo Dare, period. And which sandwich it was, the brisket or the chicken? Peace.